Now, as I was preparing this message, I asked Aaron and Jody to uh, just share with me the moment they knew that they found the one. I just said, send me a paragraph about the time, the moment that you knew. Uh, and so I just want to read to you what they said. Here's what Aaron said. He said, I realized Jody was the one pretty early into our relationship. I'm talking a couple weeks. He says, I started planning how I was going to ask her to marry me at that time. But there was a more serious time when I actually told someone in person. It was a couple years into our relationship and her family came down to Omaha for her sister Jessie's dental white coat ceremony. We had a couple days of fun celebrating with our families and I can recall the conversation I had with my dad the next day in the golf cart on the course. I told him flat out that Jody was the one I wanted to marry, and here we are three years later, getting married. And Jody says, there was no single aha moment or time when I was like, I am going to marry this man. With Aaron, it was more the everyday mundane things that solidified my love for him. It was the way he made me laugh and pursued me wholeheartedly. It was the way he spoke with gentleness and made me feel safe. It was the way he overflowed with patience and forgiveness and grace for me. It was the way he extended kindness to other people. It was the way he went out of his way to make sure I felt loved and cared for. It was the little things that over time told me there was no doubt in my mind that this was the man that God gave me to marry. So let me just say this. These words that you two just said about each other, about Joe never stop saying them. Your words have the power to build up. Today you stand before the person who it is now your sole responsibility to build up as much as you possibly can. Let that be your goal for the decades to come. Right now you stand here too single separate people. You have different last names, different families, different histories, but in a few moments, all that's going to change. Through this remarkable covenant that we call marriage, you'll no longer be single and separate. In the eyes of God, you'll become one. Two souls bound together. In the eyes of the law, you'll become one. In the eyes of your friends, you'll be one. Your spouse's family will now be your family. Your spouse's history will in a way be your history. You've come before God and these witnesses today to express your desire to be husband and wife. By the joining of hands, the reciting of vows, and the exchanging of rings, you have shown your love and devotion to each other. I pronounce that you are husband and wife. Aaron, you may kiss your bride. It's my honor to present Mr. and Mrs. Aaron and Jody Rollman.